which is basically the fortune, new plus binary, right adopt us and sundry. And I I live on this product. I love it. I drink fortune all day, every day. I make shakes with the new plus and quinary. And I just find that what Sunrider has done with their combinations of foods, especially in, in the quinary, to basically support everything in the body, the immune system, circulatory, endocrine, digestive, uh, respiratory system, that it just does exactly what Sunrider wants it to do or says it will do, which is bring balance to the whole body. And I do that every day. Um, I have new plus every morning in the shake, sometimes in the afternoon. And the other day, I was actually uh, giving a, uh, a friend of ours a ride to the airport to complain about her stomach. And I keep my autophilus in, in the car, in the armrest. And I said, well, here, eat this. She goes, what do you mean? Eat it. I go, eat it. Chew it up. Tear the corner off, just put your mouth and chew it up. And she goes, Oh, what does it taste like? And I said, It's great, it tastes like apple. And she goes, Really? And I said, Yeah. So she did. And by the time we got to the airport, I said, How are you feeling? She goes, Oh my God, I can't believe it. my stomach really feels better. I was so nervous about flying. And I mean, it was just so simple. I said, Chew it up. It, this does, and she was just like amazed. So, you know, and of course, some reason I use that all the time when I'm working around the house, or, you know, for my muscles and sore back, everything else. But I, I do, I use it all, I love it all. And, you know, you, whoever's on the call, you can go to the website, go to the fact sheet, you can look them all up. And it'll tell you what's in them, how to use them. Uh, I, to me, that's that's like my perfect day is is a wellness pack. Oh, that's great! <laughs> you know that actually, just in case anyone's wondering, that was day two on sharing when uh, Dr. Rubin was on, and um, I, I wrote down a couple of things that I thought was interesting that uh, he mentioned when he was talking about the wellness pack, and. Sometimes things that I haven't even really heard of it spoken uh, in that way. And he said the quinary actually, he called it like an herbal multivitamin to help keep the body in balance. And he recommended to take it at least once a day. But an herbal multivitamin, I thought that was so interesting the way he put that. And when he was talking about the fortune delight as a cleansing product, uh, he said that we've been exposed with so many toxins in our homes over the past couple of years, and that's why we really need to be cleansing our bodies with more fortune to light. And, of course, it has four to ten times more antioxidants than regular green tea. Um, and, you know, some of us might not have thought of that. We think of toxins outside in the environment. But because so many people have really been homebound for such a long time, uh, and that those toxins can be, you know, whether it's in our air conditioning or heating system, that the fortune delight really is an important product um, to be consuming, even more so than we would think on a, you know, on a regular basis. And um, those are a couple of things that kind of stood out to me of what he was talking about. Um, does anyone have anything else? In regard to Ruben's talk, I mean, I know he's always one of the favorites. So, wondering what anyone else might have to say. I just have a question. Uh, sure. Uh, this is Cass from Houston, Texas. Uh, what did you say? 400 times? 400 N times? No, no, no. no uh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Four, two, <laughs> ten times. Four, two, ten, ten times ten. more. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. You're welcome. Uh, I might have said it a little fast. Yes. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. Anyone else? It's always just so good to hear when uh, Ruben is talking. I, I find that you always get a little 
in Philadelphia, and that's why I'm always taking notes. And I like the way he said that Sunrider really uses out of the box approaches. And um, so things even like with the Vitadophilus, that we know most Vitadophilus on the market, uh, you know, they have a different delivery system. So, you know, sometimes they have a tablet, you know, uh, sometimes some of their products, the uh, uh, lack of affiliates products have to be refrigerated. But what really does stand out for us is that apple pectin coating that really helps to keep that good bacteria alive and be able to protect it from being killed in the stomach acid. And really, there are no other probiotics that have that approach. And that's what I think he was referring to when he was talking about Sunrider having out-of-the-box approaches. So that was in terms of those few products um, from, the, from the wellness pack. So anyone else have something you really uh, would love to share, something you heard that, you know, either confirmed what you love about Sunrider or maybe something new that you heard? Hey, Maureen, it's Mac. How are you? Hi, Marlene. Yeah. Oh, Marlene, sorry. <laughs> Got my M's mixed up. Sorry about that. <laughs> That's all right. Hey, just a general comment, not some, not specifically about Ruben. I um, I really enjoyed the three the three day breakdown. I thought that was perfect. It it kind of divided the topics over the three days. I know that was it was an investment in time, but I much preferred that than trying to spend a full day focused on training like that. Um, with day one in particular, Marlene, I, I really, I mean, Glind is always easy. She's great. I thought Judy did a great job in terms of skincare, although my goodness, she must've had a lot of products on her shelf that day because she was holding them down and <laughs> rattling off information like crazy. And then obviously I'm, I'm prejudiced because they're, they're part of my team, but to see Cheryl, Vivian and Dolphin take on the NBC, our nourish, balance and cleanse portion of the conversation uh, was just very, very, very thrilled to see that and loved hearing from them. Oh, I loved that too. I, I thought they were fabulous. And I like what you said too about breaking things down. So everything didn't feel um, you know, like there was so much information. And, and just be by dividing it over the three days. And because look, we've been through many um, conventions, right, Matt? Yeah. And there's long days of learning and so forth. And having you know one of these events each night, it really did help to, I would think, had a lot more people be able to come on, too, and then be able to go back and listen to the um, recordings. But I also agree. I absolutely love how they, your team shares the NBC. It was so beautifully done. And um, I, it was just, it was a joy to watch. You know, they are such a joy. And, and then since you're just on the phone right now, Mac, in case you weren't coming back on, I just wanted to also brag on you because you were on day three and you gave such fantastic information on how to share the business and you were just a wealth of information and you know since you're still there is there anything that maybe you could share just a couple of bullet points of you know what you were talking about? Yeah, sure. I, I appreciate that. You know, first of all, um, thank you, Marlene. I, I, I was honored to be asked to speak on day three about, well, my topic was specifically, what do we do to support and then grow our teams? And easy topic. Um, it gave me an opportunity to edify what we all do. You know, we, we go out, we talk to people, we engage in relationship, we listen, we truly practice our listening and asking the right questions. So we know what the need of the individual is. And, and for me, and I know you and I and Richard have talked about this many times, it keeps us all in integrity when we do that, because it doesn't make it about us, it makes it about them. Um, the other things that I, I just loved it. I, I, I probably owe, let's see, Renee, Maggie, and Ryan an apology because for those guys trying to translate, I know for me in particular, I get going sometimes and I forget to uh, slow the train down, if you know what I mean. <laughs> so yeah, yeah. Um, that's, that's the only so thing. Excited. Well, well, it is true. And the other thing that, that I just want to emphasize here, and I, I think anybody that's part of Rising Stars team would, would edify this as well. 
one of the things that Bob and Donna, I think, have done so well for us with Rising Stars is they have created a culture where we all do have our own voice, but we're basically saying the same thing. And I think that's really important um, for so many reasons, uh, not the least of which is it lets our message be consistent, no matter who people are hearing from that make up part of this greater expanded team of people. So again, it was so fun being a part of it. And um, thank you for giving me two seconds to chat a little bit about it here. Beyond itself. And I loved that. I thought that was a real big opening. 
was able to place the boy land pack, skin care pack, and the new cake fuel pack. A equal and choice. And I think that was beautiful. If you want to do maybe a quicker step with it, very quick result. I love the cake fuel. And I think that came across. But both packs are a great place to start. It's everybody's choice, everybody's preference. And uh, oh, everything that she went through was, was just fabulous. But I think this was top notch secret from beginning to end. Everybody has something so important. Reach everybody and really touch your heart. My heart was touched, and I've been with Sunrider almost 30 years. So it's amazing the feelings that come through with people's work. And that's the truth of what Sunrider is. The integrity that you spoke about, um, starting with the ten. I always felt that from the very beginning. The integrity from the ten really shows in their product and in everything that they do and everything that they care about and care for us. So thanks. I I really loved it. Marley, awesome. That is fantastic, Maureen. I always love your enthusiasm. I just love, love, love it. <laughs> Um, Marlene, so, oh, go ahead. I wanted to, to emphasize what Marie was talking about. It's funny because did you catch that when Judy was talking about skincare? That she sells it for more than we buy it? You know, yes. Sunrider sells it for? Yes. This yes. Is thing we, people don't, this is what I got from it. The value that Sunrider has. Yes. Whenever I hear anybody talk about, like, oh, it's expensive or the price or anything like that, I go back to the value. And I talk, I remember when Janet Tan would say, I sell this in my salon in, in New York City, the skincare and the eye cream. She goes, the eye cream is the best thing on the market. And she sells it for way more than, um, than the we buy it for and they sell it for. So I just say the value, that's what I got from it. Like, we need to be proud. Not so bad about caring with anybody because the value we have, the Sunrider, is way past what it, it just find the needs, listen to your people, but just give them, show them the value of what we have. I mean, that was for me one of the coolest things. Listen for their needs and then show that we have something that's going to fill that need. And, but I just thought that was great what Judy said about the price. <laughs> I don't I love it. I, the price of sunrise never. I always break it down like where do I sometimes I take those big packs and I can make a gallon out of it if I stretch it, you know? And I think it's about six hundred I said it's about thirty five cents a cup. If we break it down, value and then winery, you know, people complain about the price of winery, I go, Well you realize that's only seventy five cents a system when you're in your when you're eating it. So you know, five times seventy-five. You know, so anyway, I just, I kind of break it down as much as I can, and for serving or for value or whatever. And the same thing goes with all the skincare. Our skincare is so great, and yet people are spending way more than that. We just have to show the value and what it, what we have. But anyway, sorry, I'm, I sound like I'm out of breath. I'm on my bike. No, <laughs> well, but I just think you could just. I just love that whole love share growth because it's all about loving. Not only do we yeah. like the product, but you love people and you offer yeah. value and make sure you open your mouth when somebody's complaining about something. Don't just sit there and say, oh, that's too bad. No, tell yeah. them there's something we can do. And then you're going to grow because you're sharing and you're caring about people and it's a natural fit. It's not one of these marketing, I mean, I'm in Utah, they have a million multi levels. And you go to their, you know, they always have stuff on the internet. It's all about making money, right? Not once do they talk about healthy people, sharing with people, caring about people. It's all this push, 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 push. And I'm like so glad our company is about loving people, caring about people, and offering real solutions. And we have real, and yet our market. And it's probably the best kept secret on the planet because none of these other markets that these companies are pushing, saying they make money. They are close to ours. So that's what I get out of it. I go, geez, I get so jazzed. 
as I as I was then, you know, when I started. So I loved it. I thought it was great. Oh, Margie, let me just say, if I wasn't already in, can I join you? <laughs> Your excitement is so contagious. And like you say, you can still be excited after all these years, right? And and I really love what you're saying about the value also that we should not shy away because you could see, like you said, how confident both you and uh, Maureen would say how confident that Judy was about those products and then selling it for even higher because she truly understands without a doubt the value that these products have um, and can give to people. And whether you break it down into smaller amounts to still be able to show that value to people. So thank you so much. That was fantastic. Um, really, really, Bachi. So thanks for sharing that. Um, I'm just going to see if there's anyone else. It doesn't matter what day it was. Love, Share, Grow doesn't matter. Or any particular speaker or product. I just would love for everyone to share because it really means a lot um, to everyone to hear, to hear your story. Well, I just wanted to say that I uh, just kind of expressed gratitude <laughs> for all that I learned. I only was able to listen to the first night, so I'm glad that this had recorded so I could go back and listen to them. But I was just really impressed with, um, like I said, everything that was learned and that everybody <laughs> that was, everybody who's been in Colorado for a long time, they all expressed how much they learned, that <laughs> they learned so much from all of the different products. And I also think that when somebody talks about if it's expensive, you think, well, what are you comparing it to? Because you can't really compare that and say that Sunwave is expensive when you're not comparing it to anything of equal value. It's yeah, like comparing a, a diamond to a piece of glass. <laughs> you know? and so, you know, basically, I just want to say thank you, you know, express my gratitude to Sunwriter, all those who participated, because I just really learned a lot. I appreciate all their Oh, that's wonderful. And I just wanted to make sure. Who was it that was talking just now? Elizabeth. Elizabeth. Okay. Thank you, Elizabeth. Thank you for sharing that. And I agree with you 100%. Um, you know, anyone that takes their time and their passion to share uh, is something to be grateful for. I totally agree with you on that. And I think that we all, that's why I think we do these calls too, because we're even though we have been, a lot of us have been with Sunrise for a long time, there's always something new that you can learn, right? And maybe it's even in a new way of sharing with someone or just to confirm our own passion and, um, and making sure that we are spreading that to everybody else so that everyone else understands what we know that we have. So thank you for that. Appreciate it. Um, anybody else that have anything they wanted to share for any of those days? What did you love? Was there anything else new you learned about a product? What, what, I, what I thought was interesting, while someone else might be thinking about what they want to share, it was, as we said, all different types of people that were on the call, right? So we had somebody like Judy who was going through, she had so much experience and so much knowledge with the product. And then we had someone like Sharon, who is an ace royal, and she came in and she's really young. Um, and her three products, favorite products she talked about was the protein powder um, and the cake pure. We didn't actually get the third one, but so the, the protein powder and the cake pure. And what she had said that just three months after starting, her weight and her skin changed dramatically. And so all she did was started to share with her family and friends. And because they saw results, um, they wanted to know more about what she was doing. So that's, again, about us all having our personal experiences and then sharing that. And then she was saying how she uses her upline to support. Um, she keeps in contact with uh, her upline plus all her customers, everyone that she's sharing with, and that she realized just in a short time after that, she realized that she was actually sharing a business. And so I think that um, at 
know, one of the things she said is that following up and treating everyone like they are special. And I thought that was really sweet, the way she said that. And she was very, um, just so authentic and very natural, I thought. I think she was the youngest one that was speaking, that was towards the end. Uh, so I really appreciated that, too, because as we said, you know, we really run the gambit of all kinds of personalities or how long people have been involved. But one of the basic threads also through everyone is their passion and their experiences. And I think when people feel how excited you are, not just about the knowledge we have, but really um, see your enthusiasm and feel your enthusiasm, they want to know more. It just is naturally contagious. Um, so anyone else have anything else they want to share? I'm sure there's plenty more. You know, when um, I was reading about this Sharon who said that she saw results after just three months, I was thinking about, Mark, I know you're on the call, you had said you were on, and I remember hearing all of your testimonies, how you hadn't even been on the product that long, and were starting to see amazing results. So, I'm wondering, I don't know if you actually, yes, I didn't know if you actually were able to see any of that, but maybe you could just share your enthusiasm about that. No, I, I wasn't able to see it, I, I had another engagement, if you will. But I, I want to tell you something that I haven't told anybody before. I, I'll start by repeating some of what other people may not know or what occurred. I'm 75. I'm recovering from my third stroke. I'm a Vietnam veteran, so I've got problems with Agent Orange. And before I had my first stroke, I was studying to be a holistic practitioner. Um, I had my own physical therapy business for 25 years restored antiques for almost 50 for Cambridge Museum. The fact of the matter is, I look at some writers, I wish that I would have known about this 20 years ago, but last August is when I, someone turned me on to it, and I am intrigued by it. I look at these herbs, and the herbs that I've been looking for and using, I've been using almost all of them, but not quite, not quite yet, uh, Chinese golden seal, the immune system and circulatory system, uh, res uh, respiration, the, I don't know if I'll pronounce this side right, the C U J. Yeah, the C U J. Yeah, thank you yeah. very much for circulation. You're welcome. The, yeah. The Conoco for respiration and circulation, life stream yeah. for cardiovascular uh, circulation. Barrels for circulation. I look at, at these different herbs because I recognize them. Some of them I didn't know about, but I've learned. But you have to get the best for me out of these herbs and out of these products. And what they have done in that regard with ones that I just mentioned, of course, the help with binary and, and uh, uh, plus. But the fact of the matter is, I concentrated on getting these that I just mentioned. I just got back from my cardiologist today. They did a pacemaker check, and it records all uh, events that my heart does. I haven't gone into AFib. I was going into AFib two, three, four, five, or more times a day. Wow. And believe me, it's a little scary. Hmm. Uh, I have not gone into AFib for basically three months now. I. My wow. cardiovascular system is so much improved. It is unbelievable. My blood pressure is steady and, and right around for a 75 year old, uh, it's right around 117 over 68. Uh, generally, it goes up and down, but it's just staying right in that range. Uh, I, it's hard for me to really grasp how refreshing and how. For me, life-saving, this is. Going into ASAP is the precursor for a heart attack or a stroke. And I believe mm -hmm. I've been there too many times. I am so impressed with what these products are doing. Of course, the other products that I've taken are helping me lose weight, uh, I'm sleeping better. But I, I decided to concentrate on circulation and, and respiration to see what it would do for my heart. i tell you what. One of my doctors was saying, well, you're, you're going to die, but it's not going to be from a heart attack. So, well, you know, 
You are so inspirational every time I hear you. And um, I just wanted to repeat just a couple of the products that you had mentioned, okay? And tell me if I left something out. But, like, the main ones, it sounded like, anyway, I think you do NBC. So the Quinery and the New Plus and probably Cali or Fortune, I would think. And then it sounded yeah. like what you added on for extra to help with your cardiovascular, you were saying Life Cream, Siwuja, and Conco, that you kind of connect the respiratory with the circulatory. Is that what you were saying? Yeah. Oh, golden, tiny golden seal. Oh, and, and the golden seal. Yes, the golden seal and barrel. So I just yeah. wanted to repeat those um, for anyone who wants to drop those down. Um, but I, you know, one of the things that you said, Mark, that I love, which was, um, I'm not sure which word you said, but to me it sounded like curiosity, that you were so open and curious about yeah. what these products could do. And, yeah. you know, and I've heard just recently, too, that being curious about life and things that could come in is also a very healthy way to think to just be open and curious, and wow, you surely have been that, and I just appreciate so much you sharing um, what you have, and so, just, so, just, just so you know, you can, if you want to go back and see what those speakers were all sharing, you can go to the Sunrider um, page, Facebook page, they're posted there, it's also posted on the Rising Stars, that you can go back if you want to go listen to the uh, calls, the event calls that we've been talking about, and I'm sure you would love to hear what they're saying, too. So, oh, thank you so very much, very much, Mark. Appreciate thank, it. Thank you. You have a blessed day. Oh, thank you, Mark. You as well. Um, you know, you can hear, again, these is, this is the enthusiasm, and I, I also just wanted to share, you know, have Mark jump on because he didn't know I was going to ask him to, but as soon as I heard his voice, even though he had not seen these events, I know his enthusiasm and curiosity and the results he has received has been incredible. And I also, I think, very contagious. So we appreciate that so much, Mark. Um, I just wanted to just mention a couple of other things that I remember hearing on the call that I thought was, was so cute. Um, let me see. Um, so Angelica, I think she called New Plus a meltdown stalker. So I thought that was very interesting, the way that she had put that, a meltdown stock when she was talking about any of us can have meltdowns, whether it's for children or something that's going on in our life. And New Plus, of course, is part of that wellness pack. Uh, it's also, I believe, in the, in the top left product. So fantastic product. It has uh, the koi fruit in it and just a wonderful overall product that fills in all of our nutritional gaps. Absolutely love that product. Um, and let me see what else I wanted to mention about some of the products. Of course, the K Pure um, was spoken about one of our new favorite products. I know our team, we did a, a call last night on it, and I think it is just such a beautiful skincare product line. Very simple, convenient, easy, and I believe that was spoken about in. Sharon said that was one of her favorite products. Um, and let's see who else was on the call that, that might be on this call that would like to share anything else maybe that they shared or um, I don't know if Angelica's on or Emily or Nancy, Nikki, um, Bob and Donna, you were all on that second day of sharing the product. Um, let's see who else might be. So anyone else that wants to share something about what you shared or something else that you heard. Okay, everyone, you can take yourself off mute if you'd like to share. Okay, so here's a couple of other little tidbits that I heard. Just to remind everyone that uh, it was said that the youth emotion, one of the oil in products, is like Botox. So anyone that's interested in having something 
like Botox, use the most it was one of the products mentioned. Um, the skin care and the body lotion helps with itchy skin. And so some of these you can write down and you can look them up as fact sheets or ask the person who invited you here tonight and they can share more about that for you. Um, the Fortune Delight helps to metabolize stored fat. Um, Cali, which sometimes we forget, we think of just as a body cleanser. It also helps with focus. In fact, that was one of the original purposes of Cali uh, thousands of years ago. The ingredients in that would help the, um, the monk to focus. So that's fantastic. Um, let's see what else. I'm just looking through some of my notes. Anyone jump in? If something just kind of came to you, um, I, I will say, too, I love that Talk Love product pack because it really does give people a variety of products to try. So anyone who may not be wanting to get just into the wellness pack, this is such a great way to try out different sunlight products. You have the Cali, the Fortune Delight, the Sunny Dew. Um, it has the Vita Shake, the Smart Gummies, which is full of vitamins and fiber. And um, I'm trying to remember, I think Ruben was talking about it. He said that they made that for the taste like candy, but it would be a healthy candy. And that a half a tin is uh, the daily recommended amount of fiber that we need in a day. It also has B12, natural fruit juices. Um, also in that pack is the fruit and veggie rinse. Um, it was developed because there has been such a large increase of pesticides on food. And I like when she says that not only does he use it on fruits and vegetables, he also uses it on meat and fish as well. And we do the same thing. So many uses for that fruit and vegetable rinse. Uh, also the herbal toothpaste, one of the most popular products actually with Sunrider, and it's made with herbs and baking soda. No fluoride, which actually has been um, researched to be a neurotoxin. So we have a very safe, safe oral care product. Uh, I love them so much. They're great and easy to use. And I'm wondering, does anyone have anything they want to say about any of those products? Maureen, if you would like to mention anything about the, um, the oral care, especially because of your background, Oh, excuse me, I was <laughs> your fortune. <laughs> oh, my goodness. <laughs> okay, well, off the top of my head, we certainly have the best world hair line for sure. Um, let me open up a cabinet here. Starting off with the Sun Smile Herbal Toothpaste with the knee. Oh, my goodness. And the wiping gel, and someone had mentioned, which I thought was very, very important, very important to remember, that the, um, the refresher drops put on your gum and on your teeth, helping with cavities and helping with gum, that's a huge thing. That was something that I ordered right away, I was out, because I feel it's very important to protect our gums, nourish our gums. Who knew that those refresher drops could do so much? Really, really great. Uh, I love that for everybody. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That was a really good tip. And the toothpaste for everybody, whether the kids like the berry or the mint, and as you mentioned, um, no neurotoxins with the fluoride. And the herbal white smell is so gentle. It's really effective. Really, really fabulous. Why? I'm not going to pick up the <laughs> Well, thank Marty. you for jumping in. Yeah, Marty, Mark. Just a quick tip. I don't know if not most people know this, but the pressure drops are amazing on the back of your tongue. If you have a sore throat, your kids have a sore throat, anything like that, it gets rid of it. And I had a daughter. And uh, I thought it said, start putting this on your, um, whenever you're around anybody sick or anything, put this on your tongue when you've, when you've been around anybody. And sure enough, come to the trip. But the other thing was, I played cards once with my husband and I were with some friends for the weekend at a place, and she kept complaining about a throat. So I thought her word that 
Neither did her husband, but all of her kids did. <laughs> so wow. Didn't but the refresh drops are amazing for being around, whenever I'm around anybody who's been sick or doing all that stuff, refresh your drops on your tongue will kill. And I put a drop on my toothbrush with my toothpaste every night. Yeah. And um, I also had I also had a friend who had was going to schedule for gum disease at, you know, surgery. She had gum, her gum were receding and it was just a mess. So I said, just try this toothpaste. Well, she tried the toothpaste and it was like two weeks before she was supposed to go get her surgery. And when she went in for a last appointment before the doctor said, hey, what are you doing? What have you been doing? She said, what, what? She said, no, they're, they're not. They're starting to heal. They look really good. What are you doing? Because well, they just tried this toothpaste, but sure enough, she never ended up with dumpsters. So, those, our oil products are amazing. And, you know, that's the thing about that. That refresher drop, I carry it in my purse all the time. Oh, what a great tip. Oh, that's fantastic. Both Margie and Maureen. Um, I just pulled up the fact sheet just so I could tell you a little bit about the ingredients in that refresher drop. So it has urea peroxide, um, and this natural sanitizer is used as an oxidizing agent and as um, an oral care agent to help whiten teeth. So actually what's in the refresher drop also helps with the whitening of the teeth. Um, it helps to support healthy teeth and gums, as peppermint oil for fresh breath um, and clove oil, the neem tree extract, that also is the natural antiseptic, and it safely whitens teeth and supports healthy gums and teeth. So um, what I heard that too, what you said, Maureen, and I just started doing the same thing, putting it on my gums, the refresher drops. And I do the same thing you said, um, Margie. I put my toothpaste, whitening gel, and my refresher drops every time I brush my teeth, uh, a three-in-one combination. Um, but that's a great tip, too, about the sore throat and putting that uh, on the back of your throat uh, just to help do that. So, wow, great, great information, guys. Well, I think we covered a lot, even more than I realized we were going to cover. I, I'm going to close in just a minute. I just want to know if anyone else had anything else that they wanted to share from the Love Share Grove, anything else that stuck out in your mind. Okay. Well, I just appreciate everyone for sharing so much, um, all of your experiences, and anyone who's on the call that did uh, present on those calls, we appreciate you. And just remember, you can go back if you did not have a chance to participate at the time. Um, everyone gave a little bit of their uh, their idea of what they took away from it. So you've got a little bit of that tonight, but definitely go back and see uh, and listen to what else everyone was saying, because it really was a fantastic event. Um, so right after this call, we have the Rising Stars team call. And right after that, there's a Sunrider call that's open to all IBOs. It's about incentivizing yourself and following up. And you can find the links and the information to those calls on the Rising Stars Facebook page. So I just want to thank everyone for just jumping in. And whether you were prepared or not, <laughs> I think a lot of us, we just know what we love and we know what we want to share. So I thank you again. Have a fantastic week, everyone. And we will talk to you next time. Have a great evening, everyone. Thank you. Thanks, Marlene. Thank you. Thank you.